Aquino. Uh, failed presidency. Rodrigo Duterte. Leader. Bruce Springsteen. A true rocker. A true rocker in the, 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 the real sense. The late Stephen Hawking's greatest achievement. Oh, well, I think it's relatively recognized that it was his description of the event horizon around the black hole, which is essentially the distance at which, beyond which, uh, within which, the diameter around the black hole within which nothing escapes, including light. Uh, so that, 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 that really was a true revelation in our understanding of the, the universe. Juan Ponce Enrique. A deep, deep, deep thinker. The institution of marriage. <laughs> Something that uh, we are now redefining, I think, uh, because of all this talk about uh, divorce. But I, I, I think we need to go back to the original concept that it is a basis for forming a family. Grace Paul. I, I always said uh, that when she first came as a senator, she was very impressive because she was always very well prepared and very... Uh, very insightful in what she's done. I think she's continued to do that. Former President Gloria Macapagal-Arroyo. Also another very, very smart lady um, with a very good political instinct. Jaime Marcos. Jaime, oh, the, you know, the, Jaime is my ate, but uh, beyond that, uh, she, I think that people do not realize how good she is, mm -hmm. how, how, how hard she works and how again how perceptive and, and subtle is she is in her thinking. She's really very good and, and oh, really? I, I, I learned many things from her all the time. Uh, up to now she's still my ate. Kiko, I, I, I'm, I'm a little perplexed by Kiko because uh, he doesn't uh, he's not he hasn't been consistent in uh, his uh, positioning and in his pronouncements and he uh, does not tend to keep his friends for very long. Bongo. I've known also Bongo, Bongo since uh, I met uh, uh, then Mayor uh, Dikung uh, Duterte. Uh, he's very, very much the very close. He's very much. He's not only uh, the politic, uh, the personal assistant of the president, but he also has become an important part of the policy making process in government. Risa Ontiveros. Risa. Uh, well, we have never really agreed on many things in terms of uh, policy, uh, but she's, uh, I, I suppose we could say that she's passionate and, and, uh, and committed to her cause. Uh, what that cause is, uh, is, is, is uh, something that is sometimes a little hard to, to discern. PNP Chief Bato. Uh, Bato, Bato is a good policeman. He, he's, uh, he's a classic uh, good policeman who's just there to do his duty. Um, he, of course, uh, came to, uh, into the limelight uh, when President Duterte became president. But uh, since then, he has, I think, after all the commotion, he has since settled down into his groove and he has done good work in, in other parts of the country and he continues to do work as PNP chief. What about Lenny Robredo? I don't know her. <laughs> Attorney Makalanta. I know Jesse Robredo. Yeah. Because I was committed on local government, and he was the, the uh, department of uh, he was the secretary of the department of uh, local government, and we did a lot of work together, and we agreed on very many things. I hear from a lot of people it was good man. Yeah, he, he he because he was he was a mayor, so he understood the, the issues of local government right. very well from that perspective, which is the 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 really the best way to to, to understand what the local government issues are. Um, so yeah, him I knew, but I, I never, I've never actually had more than two words than uh, maybe with with his his wife. Alan Peter Cayetano. Alan, uh, he's obviously very ambitious. Um, I, I don't know that I agree with his uh, his uh, strategies of, of, of burning bridges, mm -hmm. which is something that I've seen him do. Um, it's, but uh, I, I suppose that he has decided that that's the best way for him to, to operate. The war on drugs. War on drugs is clearly necessary. Uh, and it is clearly necessary because once it began, uh, not only were the public, the Filipino public surprised about how pervasive and how deep and how wide the influence of the drug lords and the drug syndicates were in every aspect of society, in our economy, in our politics, uh, everything. Uh, not only were we surprised, 
but the president was surprised. Uh, he knew it was a problem, but didn't realize it was this big. And that is why uh, they have had to expand it and expand it and expand it. And uh, uh, it is unfortunate that uh, these, uh, those who do not live in the Philippines do not understand how it has affected and destroyed millions of lives. Favorite food? Oh gosh, Pinoy, okay. gotta be, Cuisine. gotta yeah. be. What, what exactly? Oh, you know, it's just the basic stuff. Um, uh, the basic stuff that uh, that everybody eats. I guess it's our usual adobo, sinigang, dilaga. <clears throat> and then of course, there are the delicacies in Ilocos, the pinakbit, and dare I say it, the bagnet, <clears throat> and diningding. Uh, those, are, those are foods that, that Essentially, I can't live without. Right. If I'm abroad and I'm not getting it regularly, I'll, that's how I learned how to cook. I see. Because I had to have it. And so I learned how to make it when I was in England. And uh, uh, since then, uh, it, I, it's never left my, my, my table. Uh, favorite film? I know you're a film, kind of a film buff. So uh, kind of, yeah. Three? Yeah. Oh, okay. Possibly the favorite film of all time is Apocalypse Now. Oh, good choice. Uh, good choice. That, that's, a, that's something. And then, something Scorsese. Um, you know what the you know, what I, I also like that nobody talks about? Another couple of films. I'm, I'm a big fan of Apocalypse Now. The Conversation. I haven't seen it. I haven't seen it. Gene Hackman. Brilliant. Yeah. Watch it. It's really, really good. And Scorsese, that might, might, we'll go by director. Scorsese, like everything is done, like Raging Bull, Mean Streets, man, come on. I haven't seen a single Scorsese that I haven't seen. Oh, done. you're crazy. Watch Raging Bull, watch Raging Mean Bulls, Streets. Yeah. I don't um, think it's Raging Bull, it would be the last one, but like... No, start, start with Mean Streets. Yeah, Mean Streets. Yeah. You see Wolf of Wall Street? Yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah. I like. So good too. Well, you know, that, that, at that time I was there. I saw this stuff happening. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I was, I was in New York. I was in the states at the time, and actually, you could see these crazy trader types. Oh man, okay, favorite scientific theory. It has to be the general theory of relativity. I mean, that that just changed everything. Just, awesome. just changed everything. Because it took, you know, we were in Newtonian physics for for the longest time, and. Um, that was, um, that, there's another genius, um, and you know he invented calculus, Newton, mm -hmm. and from that he was able to he was able to to calculate all of these all of these uh, f uh, physical phenomena. But the general the general theory of relativity took our understanding from what we experience on Earth uh, to what explains the universe. And the, the, the idea of time-space, for example, is uh, just, just changed everything. What's the number of government officials that are jaded? Oh. I would say, I, I, I would turn it around. How few are left that yeah. are not? Yeah, correct. But like, what's the percentage? 99%? Yeah, yes. I would, unfortunately. You know, it, you, you become a bit cynical uh, because you see things, well, you know, you go along to get along and things like that and if nothing will happen. I won't get promoted unless I go along. And so you, that, that, that promotes this kind of cynicism that, that is the only way to succeed. And it, be, it becomes the actual culture of that government. So that's a, that, 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 that's that's why I think that up to now it just cannot be cannot be fake. What do you think the best way to help the poor is? Educate them. Favorite international athlete? Do race car drivers? Uh, yes, absolutely. My my ultimate here is Ayrton Senna. Okay. Um, cool. he, you know, I, I I watched him drive, and he was doing things that we could not explain. Best Filipino vice president of all time. The trouble with that, comparing vice presidents, vice presidents tend to be waiting. Uh, you know, they're, they're at least before uh, the eighty-seven constitution, they're very much waiting in the wings and not really only you know, they do ceremonial things. So it's very hard to judge a person by that. But well, we all know who the worst one is. So let me move on. Um, <laughs> best best president of all time. Filipino, best Filipino president of all time. Uh, yeah, I may be biased, but uh, <laughs> a certain fellow from Batak by the name of Ferdinand Marcos. <laughs>